From NBC26, weather with meteorologist Matt Hoffman. Good morning. Here's a look at our Valley Tower Cam. Can't see much of anything on College Avenue with that dense fog out there. Currently 23 degrees in the city. And because the temperatures are below freezing, this dense fog is also known as freezing fog. And it can create some slick conditions out on the roads. A little bit of a glaze of ice on untreated surfaces. So give yourself, again, some extra time out there this morning. That freezing fog advisory continues for much of northeastern Wisconsin until 9 a.m. this morning. We should see conditions improve after that. But visibility right now very low across much of the area, down to a quarter mile in Sturgeon Bay, an eighth of a mile in Appleton, a, qu a quarter mile in Green Bay, as well as Sheboygan and Wapaka. Here's a look at temperatures right now. Many areas in the 20s, some teens up to the north, and these cold conditions helping to promote that uh, freezing fog out there. So heading, uh, bringing the kids to school this morning, uh, not going to be a pleasant drive by any means, but things do improve this afternoon. Mostly cloudy skies. Temperatures will warm above freezing, milder than yesterday as well. Watching a little bit of a clipper system off to our west. This could spark and touch off some uh, light snow showers and flurries late today and especially on into this evening and tonight. But all our, all our eyes are on this uh, big storm system down in Texas. It's uh, going to miss us as far as the snow goes, but it will be a big wind maker Wednesday and especially into Thursday. Could see wind gusts as high as 45 miles per hour on Thursday. Could see some snow showers as well, but the main impacts to us will be a lot of cloud cover and wind. Here's a look at precision cast. We'll deal with that fog this morning, then this afternoon, mostly cloudy skies. Some flurries try to work at us, but it's going to be kind of difficult. We're not anticipating any kind of accumulation from the snow possible later today into tonight. And then tomorrow, just mostly cloudy and windy across the area. Your forecast today up to 37, mostly cloudy after that morning fog. Some late day flurries, more flurries possible tonight with some fog as well. Here's your extended forecast. Windy Wednesday and Thursday, some snow showers Wednesday night into Thursday. Thursday, but that won't add up to much for us. And then warming up on Saturday up to 44 before a series of clippers will bring some accumulating snow chances as well as some colder air into next week. I was asking when we'd hit 50, but 44 is okay for Saturday. That'll be really nice, and we'll see some sunshine return to the area. We won't see much sun here the next couple days. All right. Thanks, yeah. Matt. Up next